Welcome everyone that's watching. Today I'm showing you how to make the perfect fettuccine alfredo with grilled lemon chicken. It's ideal for a special date night at home and it's made with lots of love. Be sure to keep on watching so we can make it together. Homemade pasta makes such a difference with this dish. I'm using the recipe from this bag of pasta flour. If you'd like to know which products I use, all the links will be available down in the description box. Measure out 300 grams of pasta flour with one teaspoon of salt and whisk together. Crack three medium eggs into a bowl and add some water to equal 150 grams. Place all ingredients into the food processor with half a tablespoon of olive oil and combine until a dough forms. That looks nice and doughy. Sprinkle a light amount of flour onto a wooden board and knead the dough for at least 10 minutes until smooth. Don't panic if the dough sticks to the board. Use a bench scraper to take it right off and don't hold back. Slap the dough and give it a workout. Wrap in plastic wrap and seal in a Ziploc bag for 2-3 to three hours. This allows the dough to set and makes it more stretchy and flexible to work with. This Alfredo sauce is indulgent and should it impress. Melt 5 tablespoons of butter on low heat. Add in one and a quarter cups of heavy cream and one cup of pecorino romano cheese. Mince up two cloves of garlic. And season with black pepper to taste. Simmer on low until the sauce thickens for about 3 minutes. Remove from the heat and set it aside once it starts bubbling. We're pairing the fettuccine with a simple grilled lemon chicken. Take 1 pound of boneless skinless chicken breast. Season with salt, pepper, and garlic powder to taste. Flip and repeat on the other side. Top with fresh parsley. Two cloves of minced garlic. Half of a lemon squeezed. Thank you Mr. Lemon for sponsoring this video. <laughs> and two tablespoons of olive oil. Mix and marinate for 30 minutes. After marinating, grill for 3-4 to four minutes on each side until completely cooked. And there we have our simple grilled lemon chicken all ready for our pasta coming up next. After 2-3 to three hours, section the dough into quarters and work with one piece at a time. Shape into a quarter inch thick rectangle with a rolling pin. Place your dough into the pasta machine on the thickest setting. Mine is number 7 and run your dough through 2 times. Repeat with the thinner settings two times each until the dough is your desired thickness. I stopped at number five, but you may go down to number four if you prefer thinner pasta. Guys, if you love pasta, give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. I upload new videos for you every week and click the bell so you don't miss out on a recipe. As you can see, this machine is amazing. For the best part, feed the dough into the fettuccine cutter.
feel free to cut that pasta shorter if you like. This should be cooked immediately after making to prevent it from cracking or becoming dry. Bring a pot to a boil with some salt. Add the pasta and check after 3 minutes to cook until al dente. If the pasta is thicker, it takes a little longer time to cook. Just keep your eye on it. It is best to cook this in a pot with a built-in strainer because homemade pasta is very delicate. If you do not have one, I'll provide an alternative option for you down below. Thank you for watching. Follow me on my Instagram, snap a picture, and tag me if you try out any recipes so I can see how they came out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.